what was it like today? You know, your final match here at Altera Woods Gym and three years in the program. Uh, it had to be a special moment for you. Yeah, it was awesome. Just being able to go out there and play with Joel and Bailey for their for all three of our last home games was just incredible. The energy in the gym was awesome, and I'm so glad we got to go out like that. Yeah, talk about playing with those two today. They've been so good for this program this year and all throughout their careers. What was it like one more time on this floor with them? Any day I get to play with Bailey and Joel is literally the best day ever, and I'm just so excited like going into the next series and being able to finish it off strong with them. That's right. Two more matches. You guys go on the road, so season's not over. But final final home one today. Uh, reflect a little on your MSUB career. What's it meant to be part of this program? I love being a Jacket, and I love like the community that comes with that. Um, everyone here is so great, and it has made my exper experience so awesome. All right. Marissa Legoza, third year senior for the Jackets. Congrats, Mar. Thanks for everything, and Thank uh, you. have fun your last two matches. Thanks, Evan. Hey, congrats on the win. That had to feel pretty good for your uh, last home match here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, re reflect a little bit on, on the experience here. You're a fifth-year senior, third year at MSUB, came in the fall of 19. Uh, that's that's a long long stretch of your life, five yeah. years at the college level. What's it been like for you? It's been awesome. Um, oh, gosh. <laughs> um, everything has been super special, and to be able to go out like this on our home court was super, super awesome. Um, yeah, these past five years have been such a long journey, but I'm super thankful for them. I'm thankful for my two-year. I'm super thankful for MSUB and all that it's given me. Yeah, today really embodied the spirit this team has, you know, an emotional win. You guys lost the first set, but against the number two team in the conference, come right back and win the next three. You, you had to fight the whole way. Talk about uh, the spirit this team has. Yeah, we have a lot of grit, and we've seen it before, um, and it was super cool that we all just decided to kind of turn that on tonight and just come out and play for a bigger purpose. Um, we knew that we had the seniors here, and it was our last time in the gym, and it was the last time in the gym for a lot of us this year, so um, we were just really coming out with a good mentality and high energy, knowing that we could take this game. Final home match for you, but season not over. You still get mm -hmm. to go on the road and play two more college matches. What do you think you'll uh, reflect on uh, the, the next week? Think back to today and the, your final two college games next week. Yeah, I think next week is going to be super bittersweet. Um, I'm really excited for them. Um, it's going to be different being done, but I think we're just going to go into them uh, just with high spirits and great energy and just um, just go out and play our game, especially for me. Like, I just want to leave on the best note possible um, with a good mentality, good energy, and that's what, I, that's what I have to bring into next week. Joel Mahal with 11 kills, led the team, hitting 321 and four blocks. Joe, thanks for everything, and uh, best of luck next week. Thanks. Hey, what, was, what was that last kill like for you? It was very emotional. I didn't know if she was going to go outside with it, but I was just ready for that moment, kind of. I told myself not to get emotional before the game, or like during it at all, and then that kind of like struck the tears, and it, it started to hit me, kind of. So it was very, very memorable, I should say. 21 kills for you today, 16 digs as well. Talk about the, the match, first of all. I mean, just a, a gutsy performance. You guys didn't get down on yourselves when you're down a set. Simon even had set point in the second, but you managed to win that one. Talk about the fight this team has. Yeah, it just really came down to that grit that we've shown before. Um, and I think that at this point, like, we had nothing to lose, and we just wanted to win for each other. And it felt very cohesive, and it felt like we were playing for one another, too. And we all just made it super fun. Like, we didn't complicate things. Um, we didn't get down on ourselves. We didn't, it wasn't negative. It was very positive in this gym. It was very positive atmosphere. Like, it was a really fun game to play. And I'm glad we came back for it. How do you reflect on the, the last five years, you know, being such a big part of this program? And um, what does it mean to you to play here? It means so much to me. It really shaped me into the person that I am today. Um, and as sad as I am that it's over, I'm just really excited to get my life going. But I'm very, very thankful for everything that this place has brought me, um, this conference has brought me, my teammates, my coaches, my family. Um, so I'm really excited for the next step. But this is a really good way to go, I think. All right, two more matches for you in your Yellow Jacket career. Bailey, just want to say thanks for everything uh, you've done the last five years. Best of luck next week, and thanks. really uh, meant a lot to this school. Thank you. I appreciate it. First of all, congrats on the win. Uh, what, a, what a gutsy performance by you guys. Yeah, it really was. You know, we didn't come out as hot as I wanted us to, but to be able to fight and all the grit that we showed today, especially on senior night, especially with this group of seniors, it's just so special, honestly.
Had to be Bailey Muck for the last one there to, to give you guys the victory and uh, just start there. I mean, what a career. Uh, one of the best to ever suit up here. Going to finish yeah. sixth in, in kills uh, among many, many other things. But had to be her to finish it and uh, a classic performance from her tonight. Yeah, I mean, I'd expect nothing different. Uh, Bailey has been our rock for the past five years or so. So uh, to be able to end it like that and from a pass from Marissa, I mean, just really cool and a special moment. Um, I mean, she's just put in so much to this program. She's been so loyal. She's uh, just done so many wonderful things. And to be able to uh, have her go out with a win, and especially a win like that, I think was awesome. And, um, yeah, couldn't have asked for it any other way. And uh, just got to sneak this in there, but became the first player today with that those couple service aces she had to be in the top four in kills, digs, blocks, and service aces all time. Yep. Not shock by, shocked by that. Um, I mean, I think we'll be writing her Hall of Fame speech for the next couple of years, getting ready for it, because, I mean, I can't think of anyone more deserving. But, um, I mean, what a special player, what a special career she's had. Um, just happy she could go out the way we wanted her to. Joelle Mahold uh, got to have her for the final three years of her career, a fifth-year senior as well. Um, another special player for you. Yeah, I mean, Joelle's energy is infectious. You can see it in the way that she plays. Uh, she had such a gritty performance tonight, too. Uh, being, I mean, the hitting percentage, the blocks, the serves, the aces, everything that she does for us. Um, she just does it with so much heart. So uh, great performance from her tonight. Um, and, yeah, excited for these next couple of games because I feel like we can get another couple under our belt. And Marissa Lagozo as well, a third-year player for you. So scrappy defensively, and she was uh, big time tonight. Had a big impact in this game defensively, and <laughs> had that service ace to win the set for you. Yeah, um, Mar crushed it. Honestly, she came in uh, middle of the second set, and I mean, passed lights out. I think she was around like a 2.3, which is awesome. Uh, made some super scrappy plays, and then serving-wise, got them out of system, and then had that ace to kind of clutch it. Um, but super proud of her. She came off the bench a ton, brought crazy energy, was a little spark plug, so uh, super proud of her. Regular season home finale and a, and a great win. Season not over, though. You go on the road, two more tough matches. This will give you some momentum, though. You'll, you'll play at Northwest Nazarene Thursday, Central Washington Saturday, and a, a big uh, good step this week to get you ready for those. Yeah, for sure. Um, you know, I think that we played um, both Central and NNU so early that it's kind of hard to remember exactly uh, how they play, but um, I'm super excited, especially if we play the way that we did tonight, to be able to end our season the way that we want to um, and send our seniors off in the best possible way. All right, Yellow Jacket head coach Casey Williams, congrats on a really big victory today and a special day in the gym. Yeah, thank you, Ev.